Hello students. Today let us learn one concept: multiplication of polynomials. Before this, we have studied types of polynomials. The polynomials are classified according to the number of terms they have. That is the types of polynomials based on the number of terms and based on their degrees. So, if there is only one term in a polynomial, it is called as a monomial. If there are two terms in a polynomial, they are said to be binomial. And if there are three terms in a given polynomial, it is called as a trinomial. And some of the types of a polynomial based on degree are linear polynomial, quadratic polynomial, and cubic polynomial. So, if degree of a polynomial is one, it is called as a linear polynomial. If the degree of given polynomial is two, it is called as a quadratic polynomial. And if the degree of polynomial is three, it is called as a cubic polynomial. So these are the some types of polynomials which we have earlier studied. Today our main point is how to multiply two polynomials. So those polynomials may be monomial, binomial, or a trinomial. So let us have an example and let us see how to multiply the polynomials. So the question is multiply. Minus 2a into 5a square. As we can see here, there are two monomials. It is minus 2a is the first monomial, and 5a square is the second monomial. And we have to take a product of these two. So for this, for the first polynomial, the coefficient is minus 2, and for the second one, coefficient is 5. So we have to multiply these coefficients separately. So, so the next step, firstly, we should multiply these coefficients that is minus 2 into 5 into we'll collect the remaining terms in the first polynomial and in the second polynomial that is a into a square so as minus 2 into 5 it will be minus 10 into a into a square so that is equal to minus 10 into we have a into a square that's a cube the product of these two polynomials that is minus 2a into 5 a square is minus 10 a cube let us have another example the question is multiply m square minus 5 into m cube plus 2m minus 2 now this is the example of a product of binomial and a trinomial so in the first polynomial as there are two terms it is called as a binomial and in the second polynomial we have three terms that's why it is called as a trinomial now let's see how to multiply these two. For this one, we have to multiply the second polynomial by each term in the first polynomial. So in the first polynomial, the first term is m square. So we have to multiply the second polynomial that is m cube plus 2m minus 2 by m square. And the second term in the first polynomial is minus 5. So we have to multiply the second polynomial by minus 5. So it should be minus 5 into m cube plus 2m minus 2. We have to multiply each term in the bracket by m square. That is m square into m cube plus m square into 2m minus m square into 2. Similarly, we have to multiply each term in the second bracket by 5. That is minus 5 into m cube minus 5 into 2m. And here, this time we have two negative numbers that is minus 5 into minus 2. That's why product of these two negative numbers will be positive. That's why plus 5 into 2. Now in the next step, we should have the product of these two terms that is m square into m cube. That's m raised to 5 as the bases are same. We should add the indices. That's why 2 plus 3, it will become 5. That is m raised to 5. Similarly, 2 into m square into m that's m cube minus 2 into m square minus 5 into m cube that's minus 5 m cube minus 5 into 2 that's 10 m plus 5 into 2 that is 10 here we have to add or subtract the like terms so the like terms over here are so m raised to 5 is a single term we will take m raised to 5 as it is and 
plus 2m cube and minus 5m cube are the like terms so we should add these two and the result will be plus 2m cube minus 5m cube it will be minus 3m cube minus 2m square as it is minus 10m plus 10 so this is the polynomial that we get after multiplying m square minus 5 and m cube plus 2m minus 2 so this is the way by which we can have the product of binomial and a trinomial so in this way we can have the product of any two monomial binomial or trinomial or monomial and a binomial or binomial and a trinomial